So I'm not going to edit this video because this will be a quick theory video and um, the volume might be slightly low. My other videos, the volume is high, but the volume will be slightly low, so I apologize for that. I was taking a look at uh, Kratos and, uh, you know, Greece and uh, where Greece is actually in, in the world of God of War Ragnarok. And this is the, in, in, during the ending of God of War Ragnarok, Kratos takes a look at this image which uh, I don't really remember what they were called in the in the in the in the game. I think they were called murals. I'm not sure, but he takes a look at this mural and he basically he basically sh uh, this basically shows him being worshipped by either the Norse people or the Greek people. I'm not sure what this what this is basically. But we do know in God of War 2018 that he did see a ways of, you know, ways where the younger Kratos could, could be, uh, was drawn, basically. Uh, the younger Kratos could be seen, which kind of implies that Greece has been rebuilt after the death of Zeus and all the other gods. You could see even uh, like the, you can see in the pictures if you t do a quick Google search that the ways that had the young Kratos also had another ways right next to it where it kind of implied that Greece was rebuilt successfully. And uh, I believe Tyr was the one who basically got the uh, uh, was going in collecting stuff from other worlds and other dimensions and other pantheons. This could imply that we will probably see Kratos' return to Greece someday. So completely completing his arc there and he's going to go back into uh, to Greece to rebuild Greece and you know uh, probably defeat Athena. That is that is my theory. The theory is that Athena is probably going to be the the person that is well is basically going to make living in Greece a problem. Kratos with Arcreus will probably return to Greece or Arcreus alone will return to Greece or not return to Greece, never went to Greece, will go to Greece to defeat Athena. That is what I believe. Uh, Athena was very power hungry the last time we saw her. So there is a chance that she is going to... Well, Kratos will have this mission where he's going to go back to Greece and then, you know... Uh, save Greece from Athena or and this is just my theory however this mural or this image whatever it is this doesn't seem to indicate that he, he is going back to Greece at least I don't think it is because you can see that the armor on this person looks like it's from it's an it's like Nordic it doesn't look like it's uh, it's Greek like the armor on the on the right side of this this little giant thing on the on the right side underneath Kratos so there is a there is a thing that um, Kratos will probably go to Greece and people will start worshiping him as the savior of Greece from Athena, or he'll just go back and just rule Greece as he was supposed to as a peaceful god. It would have made more sense if the red red uh, this tattoo of his turned blue. That then it would have mean that he's the god of peace now. But that's not the case. I wish it was blue. That would have clearly implied that he is a god of peace. But people are worshipping him. Probably both in the Norse um, in the Norse realm as well. If he ever goes to Greece, he, they will worship him in Greece as well. We do have an indication that Greece has been rebuilt though. So let's see what happens in God of War 5 or 6 whenever it comes out.